What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Sorry about the noise, it's just my fan. It's on at the moment because in here it's really warm and my, I don't want my window open because it's raining outside. So, I have a very controversial topic I want to talk about today in today's video on Thomas Bradshaw and it's about bullying. Because I received a Facebook message off a, not, I wouldn't say a close friend, but it's someone I know from my primary school. And they were actually talking to me how I got through my stage of bullying while at school. So guys, bullying, everyone knows what it is. And if you don't go through it in your lifetime, you're probably the one causing it. And bullying, from my perspective, it's just horrible. When I was being bullied, I felt like committing suicide pretty much most days. And sometimes people don't even know that they're bullying someone else. Such as it can just be calling someone names or saying, oh, your shoes are Nike or Adidas or something like that. That can be classed as bullying. It doesn't just have to be punching and threatening and things like that. In my case, it was pretty much all. Um, I was getting the mix to count me for who I liked, um, what brands I wear, like this Real Madrid t-shirt here, my weight... Um, and to, I luckily my bullying got sorted out and it wasn't such as easy for him which I hope it does get solved for you mate but it, sometimes it can be really hard two of the bullies actually came to my property and we if they if the bullies do come to your property you are allowed to phone the police as it's trespassing on your private property and trying to do something to you in my case they were trying to fight me in front of little kids, that's really bad too, setting a bad influence for them. Um, if you want to commit suicide, do not. No self-harm, guys. If your dog scratches you, that's a different story, but <laughs> just no self-harm, guys, because that gets no, you get nowhere with that. That just gives shows the bullies they're winning. And one day, guys... If you are getting bullied, the anger's going to build up inside of you and just keep building and building. And one day you're going to snap and then they're going to be truly, truly forgiveful. Because I'm not really a violent person, although I do boxing. It's a good way to let out anger. And when I was getting bullied, my um, anger was just building up and building up and building up. And one day I was going to snap. And when I get violent, I get really violent and I don't stop. Um, you can actually class it as self-defence too. So that's another reason why it's in your favour. But also, if you, let's say you knock one of them out. That will show them bullies not to mess with you. And they will move on. But I don't want anyone to be bullied. So the best way to stop bullying is... Don't do it. Just, if you have an opinion, keep it to yourself. Don't even be bothered to say it if it's not nice. For example, oh, look at him. His shoes are a bit worn down. Don't say it because they can make themselves... They, that can make the person feel really bad about themselves. But if it's a compliment like, oh, mate, your shoes are really nice. Where did you get them from? So on, etc. That's a compliment. And what you want to do, guys, keep your friend circle small, people you can trust. Because me, I had a small set of friends and they actually helped me go through it. Shout out to them. But I hope, sorry about that guys, but I hope if you're getting bullied, um, this video has helped you on what my I had to deal with. Because I know it is very harmful. My like no one could cope in my house. Um, I wasn't getting sent into school, missing out on bunches of education, threatening to be battered on the way home. But I found a new outlet, which is expressing it through rap and also going to boxing, letting off a bit of self-esteem there. But. Like and subscribe guys, if you want more helpful tips on any subject, leave it in the comments below. Peace out guys, and later.